Hello and welcome back to another vlog. I'm just sat about to do my makeup because I'm going to London today just for one night but I'm very excited because it's been a while since I was there and I feel like it's been a while since I've done a vlog doing something like fun like this. So we're going down for one night because my boyfriend has a gig down there. Um, so he'll be playing at Brixton Jam um, this evening. And it's going to be a late one. He's not on till half past two in the morning till four. So, yeah, it is a it is a late one. But I think I'll be okay because I don't think we're going to go to the club until later on. If you've not watched my videos before, then uh, my boyfriend's a DJ, so that's what he's doing tonight. But I am looking forward to it. To it'd be nice for us to have a trip. Um, and hopefully we'll get a little bit of time in London to do some other bits. It won't be much because we don't get there until around four o'clock and then we need to make our way to Brixton and get settled in the hotel and stuff. So it's not going to be like a, you know, we're not packing it with loads of stuff, especially with him working late, leaving about half an hour to drive to Sheffield, which is where my boyfriend lives and where we're getting the train from. And then we'll be getting the train from there. It was cheaper to get the train from Sheffield than it is Manchester. So it works out pretty nicely, actually, to be fair. I'm debating not putting makeup on because I'm going to have to redo it again when I get down there later before we go out. But I thought, you know what, it'll make me feel a little bit more awake and put together. So I might as well do it. So I'm going to finish doing my makeup and I'll check back in with you when I'm ready to go. I need to finish packing, get all my stuff together. I need to knit to the shop, actually, because I did actually win on the lottery. I won £20. I know. I know. She's rich. I'm going to go and collect that and that can be a little bit of spends for London because we are still trying to be careful with money and we're still saving to pay my huge electricity bill off. <sighs> it's all fun and games being an adult, isn't it? Right, you have to hold it there. Hold it there, okay. Say hello, vlog. Oh, work. oh my god, that is the cutest thing in the world. Okay, I am finally in the car. I'm ready to go. I'm about seven minutes later than I wanted to be. But I did give myself a half an hour buffer to make sure that I was on time and not late. So I should be okay. I'm going to set off now. I'm sweating because I've been running around getting my last minute bits ready and I was really conscious of the time. I'm just going to put my playlist on, get driving and fingers crossed we'll make good time and there'll be no traffic because that half an hour's already had seven minutes out of it so keep your fingers crossed for me we arrived at the train station been in m and picked up some lunch i got caesar salad and a flat jar and a bottle of water and we're just stood waiting for the train so we're on the second train at the hotel it was a little bit of a fact to get here but it's okay we're here now the room is actually really nice so i'm going to give you a quick look around and yeah before we get all of our stuff out huge bed it's literally massive and tv over here little sofa little chair and then this is the view very cute we've got a little tea and coffee station we've got some fresh milk down from the bar i'll put the kettle on we're going to unpack chill out for a bit and then probably start thinking about where we're going to go for some food because it is 20 to 6 actually so it's getting on a bit so we managed to chill out for a bit and now we're going to go out and find something to eat we did have a look online and there's a place nearby called i think it's called the power station which from what i can gather it's like a 
place with loads of different restaurants inside. So I think we're going to walk down there, which I think it was like 0 0.2 miles away, so it wasn't far, and just see what we can find there. Rather than getting something delivered, it would make the most of being able to go out. So we're going to go and see what's there. We've come to Street Pizza, and it's bottomless pizza for £17. Apparently it's Gordon Ramsay restaurant, but they just bring the slices round. What is shit? They bring the slices round and offer you it, the flavour, but you don't get to pick. So you can't say, can I have 10 pepperoni? They just bring it round and you say yes or no. So that's what we've come for. Everywhere else is really busy, so we just came in here and we got a table straight away, which is really good. So we'll see what the pizza is like. meal and it was really nice actually and um, it was kind of like stone baked pizzas and they just bring like the full pizzas around and then give you a slice of like each one so you don't like ask them for it it's just they bring all the flavors around basically and you say yes or no so we did that then we had a walk around a shopping center i think i took some clips but it was a really nice shopping center actually loads and loads of shops um i think it's called a power station so uh, we went in there and then we did have a walk to what we thought was going to be Marks and Spencers but Google Maps clearly isn't up, date, up to date because it wasn't there when we got there so no dessert for us and no food to tide us over till we need to leave at like one. We're going to try again I think, see if we can get some food because even though we've eaten now we're going to be leaving at like one so that will have been like five, six hours since we will have eaten. So we wanted to get some kind of snack or something to tide us over and maybe some dessert as well. So yeah, it's a nice night actually. It's like not cold, not raining. It's quarter past 12, so I'm gonna sit and do my makeup. I've just set everything out in front of me and they actually do have this little light that I'm using now, which is perfect for makeup because as I was saying before, it's quite dark in here. so. I was a bit gutted really that I would have to do my makeup in the dark but then I realised there was this little light and I thought it was going to be shitty but it's actually really good and look at the difference it makes such a big difference makeup is all done and I've just gone for something really simple and then I've gone for a brown liner because I've been doing this recently and I love it and I wanted to show you a product that has been making it so easy I have always really done my winged liner with shadow because I find it easier. I hate liquid liners, I find them messy. I just think you have to put a lot of effort in for the same result that shadow can get you basically. But I got this in a glossy box and it's TYNT Phantom Liner. I don't know if I'm tint maybe. I don't know if I'm saying it wrong. Um, it's not gonna focus, is it? Because my camera's been playing up. But this is it, basically. I'll see if I can link it down below. It is the nicest, just like a really nice brown. The nib is really fine and it goes on really well. So I just wanted to share that. So I'm just gonna take my hair out and then I've literally just gotta get dressed. So I'm gonna show you my outfit because I've got some new bits and then we'll, we'll be ready to go. I think we're just gonna leave a little earlier than planned. I think it's around quarter to it's not quarter to one is it i think it's about quarter to one now so we're gonna leave um as soon as i'm ready basically so hair is all done i just used my trusty amazon wand that i've literally had I'm, i swear i must have had this for about seven or eight years and it's never failed me so i just did um some curls put it in pin curls and then i brushed them out i'm gonna pop a little bit of hairspray on to try and keep them in but they're looking pretty good okay, the lighting's not the best in this mirror to be honest but this is what I'm wearing. So I've got these new jeans from River Island. Well, they're actually from ASOS, but the River Island jeans. And then I've got my H&M top on. It's like a Skims dupe one. And then I've got this new jacket from Zara. So this is my outfit and we're all ready to go. We are here at the club. I'm just in the little backstage thing, making a drink. My boyfriend's just about to go on stage. Um, trying not to let anyone catch me doing this because obviously this is not what we're here for. like obviously I'm here with him at his work if that makes sense but I still got a vlog so it's fine so just pouring us 
a little drink is about to go on. I get a couple of clips, but I don't know what the sound's gonna be like. It's really loud in there. Um, but yeah, it's currently 2:30, just about to go on. <laughs> morning now it is just about 11 o'clock so we're just checking out we have literally left it last minute because we're tired we probably had about maybe five hours sleep so we're definitely feeling it but we're gonna go and head towards the train station now and then probably find somewhere for breakfast hopefully we'll have plenty of time um it did it take us a while yesterday because we did end up getting on the wrong stop so it was a little bit longer than it should have been but we're going to head out now. I've just actually noticed that it's raining outside. So that'll be fun because I think there's like a 15, 20 minute walk to get to the underground. So, so we've ended up with the to Greg's because there wasn't really anywhere else to get into. So we've got some goodies. Breakfast is finished, so we've ended up with sausage rolls and pasties. Just had the emergency alert thing. Why didn't you get one? Didn't get one. You didn't get one. The phone's ending. It was an alert, an emergency. I don't know why I didn't get one. Well, prepared now. Except for you. I wonder why you didn't get one. That's really weird. Everyone else got one. I mean, it's gone in it, expected. We actually forgot that it was happening until the train driver announced that going to be doing it weird it is the next day now i got back from london yesterday and i've actually just finished editing the video then realized i didn't leave it off anywhere but basically we got back to sheffield and then pretty much just crashed we had some tea we had a domino's um which we did have pizza twice in a row and i didn't realize that after I, until after i'd eaten it but we had a domino's i had a nap I came back to Manchester. I think I got back about 10 o'clock and I was so tired. I got in bed, I watched a couple of episodes of Scandal and then called it a night. I managed to get a little bit of a lie-in this morning because I'm a bit on a later shift than um, rather than an early. So I definitely appreciated a little bit of extra sleep. But um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I sometimes feel like the, when I vlogs, it, like the, I felt like this might be a little short this video but then sometimes like my boyfriend did remind me it was like obviously long form like really long vlogs like I know Gemma Louise Miles always does like half an hour to an hour on her vlogs and they don't always have to be like that I mean I think this one will probably be around 15 minutes or so by the time I've added this clip in so that is still a good amount of time I feel like Sometimes with vlogs, when you look back, you feel like they're a little choppy and you don't know whether people will find it entertaining or find that annoying. Or So I always struggle really with like how much to do throughout the video. But I mean, it was a fun little trip to London So and I've done the vlog. So I'm definitely going to put it up. Hope that you enjoyed it. My next vlog after that one will be a at home vlog so i've got a few things a few fun things planned today which i'm going to be doing um soon so i'll be videoing that and then also the weekend coming up is actually trying to get my dates a bank holiday so you won't be you'll be seeing this afterwards though yeah so the one after that will probably be a bank holiday vlog or I don't know which way around I'm going to do it. Honestly, I feel like my head's all over the place today. I think the tiredness is still affecting me from yesterday. But basically, I'm also going out for bank holiday with the girls. So I'm thinking of either doing maybe like a little get ready with me slash bottomless brunch vlog. I don't know. I always find it really weird when, it's, when I'm with other people. Because I'm like, do they want to be on the vlog? Do I want to pull my camera out? Do I want to just have fun? So I'm thinking I might try and vlog it and if it's a good video then I'll post it. If not then I'll give it a miss and we shall see. But the next video you'll see after this one will be at home. I have got a fun masterclass to do. I've got some new makeup bits to show you. So um, it'll be a little bit more of a relaxed and at home one but with some fun elements to it. So again thank you very much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope to see you here again very soon. Bye!